So the value net uh, is a grid like lots of other powerful but straightforward uh, business models. And what we have, very much like Porter's Five Forces, is the uh, power of customers uh, and the power of suppliers. Um, what we have here, though, uh, as opposed to uh, Porter's Five Forces, is the power of uh, partners and the power of rivals. Now, what we have is today's partners will tomorrow, could tomorrow, become your rivals. And due to outside forces, mergers, acquisitions, etc., you could also find that your rivals are becoming your partners. So we've got um, potentially partners becoming rivals, rivals becoming partners. And then our suppliers are always being persuaded uh, by rivals to uh, um, uh, integrate with them. And then obviously customers are always being persuaded. So uh, this really is one of those competitive advantage models which extends the idea that uh, competition is uh, never static, always changing. And then what we do is we use uh, decomposition models like uh, the primary function of the value chain to represent the company, to represent the organization, the business unit, the firm, etc. So inbound logistics, operations, outbound logistics, sales and marketing, service and margin. Um, and what we do is we superimpose this model um, onto our decomposition models. And we combine it with other models. So, for example, Portis 5 Forces would be uh, a good one here to give us an extended, enhanced com a picture of the competitive environment. Now, we go over all of that in the uh, more than 150 uh, video lessons which you can purchase from the website. Um, so, that's more than 150 video lessons going over more than 150 critical business models. And this in red is a number one. So that is not an L, that's a number one. So it's VA number one UE hyphen chain dot com. You can purchase all those video lessons from there.